How's it going guys? Welcome outside. We are going for a full 30 minute total dry land here. It's the full spectrum from warm up to warm down. So all you need to know is we're going to be splitting it up into a few groups. That's going to be the warm up. We'll hop into core, follow that by a full body, high intensity workout. And then we're going to be going into strength for all the different muscle groups. So we're going to go to legs. We're going to do chest, shoulders, and back. And then we're going to finish it off with a stretch warm down. So, all right, just in five seconds here, we're gonna get started with the dynamic warm up. First exercise, forward arm swings, 15 seconds. And switching to the other side. Make sure to keep the arms relaxed. Let your hands pull your shoulder all the way 360 degrees around that socket, nice and loose. And now backwards, on both directions. Not gonna be driving anywhere anytime soon. And other arm down. We're gonna do some bear hugs. Make sure to stretch out your chest and your shoulders. Try to touch your hands behind your back. Get them as high as possible. All right, from here we're gonna do some walkouts, 30 seconds. And do a nice push up all the way at the bottom. Start to warm up those arms, the legs, get a little stretching. All right, from here we're gonna stretch your quads. Just do 15 seconds. Alternating legs. Just hold it long enough to feel the stretch. Not too much longer. All right, we made it through the warm up. Now we're gonna get into the core workout. So we're gonna go 30 seconds on, 15 seconds off for the first section, and a two minute burnout. So super crunches, let's go. Keep your posture strong, lower back straight, chest out if you can. Focus balance over speed. All right, that should get your core nice and warmed up. Take 15 seconds rest, then we'll be going into super twist. Thirty seconds. Here we go. All right, another 15 seconds rest. We're gonna go into side plank to side planks, alternating. Reach to the sky on each one. You don't need to hold it for too long.
All right, 15 more seconds rest. We're gonna go into a plank position and do some leg extensions from there. That's gonna be the first section of the core warm up. Keep your posture in line. Don't let your hips sag, don't let them pike. Keep your lower back stable. If you want to have some fun with it, try to balance a tennis ball on the back. Don't let it drop. Fifteen seconds rest. Now we're gonna go for two minutes non-stop. Starting with leg raises. Keep your lower back glued to the floor and your legs as straight as possible. Now we have Newton's Cradle. We have 15 seconds of flutter kicks and 15 of scissor kicks. You're gonna feel the burn here. We're gonna be switching from core to full body after this, so push through it. Good job, guys. Get a full 30 seconds rest here. You earned it. You have some fun in the turf here. Doing a streamlined tuck and roll. So it's four kicks and a log roll.
good job. That's part one of three on the full body high intensity. Got 30 seconds to rest. Starting with streamlines to brush stroke kicks. Switch over, ready to go. Push up, the side plank. All right, that's two of three on the high intensity full body. Got another 30 seconds rest. Getting into the last part. Yeah, I should be pretty warmed up right now. You know, here it's the middle of December. It's about 50 degrees out. What a beautiful day, right? We're gonna do a walkout with the push up and a squat. That's it for the full body. Now we're gonna slow it down just a little bit. Get into strength exercises. We're gonna start with our lower body. Doing seven minutes here.
Alright, from here, go standing to warrior pose. Hold it for just a second and stand right back up. Make sure when you're standing to press up through your heel on the front foot. We're going to go from kneeling to standing. Hold the strong posture. Press through the heels coming up. Alternate which foot you're stepping up from. All right, that's round one of three. Now we're gonna bring the glutes into the picture. Get ready to get into a streamlined position. We're gonna get into some glute bridges. Here we go. Feel it in your legs. Feel it on your fingertips and feel it in your head. Just let your body go. Just let your body go. Just let your body go and move to the rhythm. Now we roll over, we're doing kickbacks. Just one more section of legs and then we're moving on to upper body. This one focuses on calves too. We're gonna get down to an iso lunge hold. 30 seconds here. Excuse me if I accidentally took 15 seconds of rest just prior. It was supposed to be 30. You guys are athletes, you can handle it. All right, now we're just gonna roll forward into a calf raise. Go slower and controlled. Focus on holding your balance. 
better than I'm doing. We're going to the ISO lunge again. Other side. Keep your chest out proud, your shoulders back. It's kind of like warrior stance from yoga. Just a little more advanced. All right, 30 seconds rest. Actually 30 seconds this time. Then we're gonna get into the upper body. Work some shoulders, some of our back. And guess what? We're almost done. So if you wanna get ready, we're gonna get started doing push-ups. We're gonna start narrow grip, go wide to one side, back, wide to the other. arm circles, bend over a little bit, point your thumbs up, and really pinch your upper back. Halfway through the chest section and back. You guys ready for the last working set? After this, it's easy. It's just stretching, warm down. So push through. Give it all you got. We're gonna start with archer push ups. Go nice and wide. If your chest is burned out at this point, feel free to do them from your knees. Man, I love this. They're so underrated. Really pinch those back muscles together. Give it a pause at the top.
Alright, flip me back over. And from here, we're gonna do lean overs. So try to position your hands so that they're in between your chest and your hips. And just extend into a full plank with your body straight and leaning over your hands. Oh, congratulations, you made it. Now you have 30 seconds to rest. It's more like 15 now. And some static stretches from here. Good job, guys. Good job. You're making me feel like an old man. On the cross. Get the shoulder a nice stretch. Make sure this arm right here is nice and straight in a lockout position, and this one is applying force backwards. And switch side. Such a beautiful day for early December. We're in uh, Chicago suburbs, by the way. It's usually pretty cold this time of the year. All right, now bring your hand behind your back and just pull it across in that direction. If you need to, it also gives you more stretch. You kind of pull your hips out and pinch it. And same thing, other side. Nicely done. Here, legs apart. We're gonna go 15 seconds to each foot. Just kind of let yourself sink in, nice and relaxed. And the other side. We got two more after this. I'm gonna go into a warrior pose for the hips, and then a cheerleader stretch for our glutes and hamstrings and our spine. There you go, hands inside the foot. Bring your hips down. Try to bring your chest up proud. Really sink in towards the ground. So I hope you guys like this workout. Sure as hell kicked my butt. If you wanna see more videos like this, make sure to hit that like button. Smash the subscribe button. And just stay tuned. Also, if you want to see anything specific, whether it's a leg workout, back workout, in the pool workout, let me know what you think in the comments below. So I'll be more than happy to make those. Last one.
All right. Cheers, guys. Hope you're feeling wicked good. Have a great day.